Hi guys, Jamie here, Divinely Canadian Tarot. I am here to do a uh, reading for you guys for the sign of Sagittarius. And before we get started, we're going to clear all the negative energies. So if you do have sensitivity to loud noises or you're wearing headphones, please reduce your sound. Okay, or lower it, whatever. I'm French. Okay, sorry, reduce your sound. I always say close the lights and people make fun of me. Anyway, let's move on. So Sagittarius. Sagittarius, let's get into your reading. And remember that uh, messages may or may not resonate. Leave the ones that don't resonate. Keep the ones that do. Otherwise, it can get very confusing. Uh, cards in the reverse, meaning when they come in upside down, I read intuitively. So I'll provide you the messages I receive from spirit guides. Uh, okay, we're starting off with uh, the uh, French vampire deck. This one's called uh, Le Tarot. Vampire, no, no, le tarot interdit vampire. Interdit is like, uh, you know, you're not allowed in or, or uh, what, what do you call it? Like, uh, it's forbidden, I guess, forbidden vampire tarot. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's see what energies we have for you guys, Sagis. We have le six d'argent, the six of pentacles. So, uh, yeah, you, uh, you're a big giver. You like to help out a lot. You like to give to charity as well, I guess. Quatre de pieux. Mm, and you have uh, a lot of uh, desires, and uh, I feel like you're you're looking for uh, you're looking for love. Is what I'm getting with that four of wands. La tempérance. That here you are, Sag. Your energy, Sagittarius, is the temperance, and uh, it's an energy of healing. Trying to find some balance. Trying to uh, Find someone to become, you know, two souls into one. You're, you're, you're twin flame. You're searching. You want that. You want that connection, that love that everyone dreams and talks about. But all you keep finding is this crap. Psych DP, the five of swords. You know, it's like defeat, deceit, lies. People just pretending to be someone they're not. And we've got Éclaireur de Pieux. This is the Page of Wands. So uh, let's get some clarity here, Sag. And we're going to clarify with uh, the English Vampire Tarot. <laughs> okay, so Six d'Argent, the Six of Pentacles, please. I do feel like you are someone who gives, 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 and people take advantage of you. They figure, you know, oh, you'll forgive, yeah. I feel like you're just like, yeah, done with that judgment. Yeah, I feel like that's you getting that wake up call you need to realize. Um, yeah, I need to do something different with my life. I need to let the past go and allow myself to have a new beginning. So I feel a lot of energies of needing to let go are here. Sorry, I'm a little anal when it comes to that. Whoa, 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 wow, wow, wow. wow. Got the page of wands again. Page of Wands here, Page of Wands here. All right. Well, I feel like you haven't had fun in a long time. So I feel like you're too busy taking care of everybody else's needs but your own, right? And look what this is, the Chariot Cancer Energy, the wagon. You need to move your life in another direction, in another direction, because uh, what you're doing is not working for you. Okay, so you need to, uh, you want some fun, you want some excitement, you want to find your person, well, keep going doing the same thing over and over again, ain't gonna get you there, just saying. So, uh, the four of wands we're clarifying next here, the hermit, yeah, take some time, go soul searching, 
Find your light, your path, your way, the direction you want to go in. Don't let people tell you who you are. You tell them who you are. You're fire, Sag. You tell them. So, yeah, totally getting that you need to do that. You, you're protecting yourself. You're guarding yourself. Seven of Wands. No one can get through. Mmm. Jonathan the Fool. <laughs> Well, well, this is the energy of a new beginning. Let the past go right out the window. You don't need it. What are you holding on to it for? Just so you keep, keep reliving it? You're living the pain? You're living the past? What's that doing for you? Well, F all, really. Really, it's just not doing anything good for you. So why are you holding on to it? Heal. Let it go, Sag. Temperance, that's you. Let's clarify that temperance energy here. Clarify the temperance, please, for the sign of Sagittarius. Oh, we've got the page of water. Someone has a crush on you. Mm-hmm. Or you got a crush on somebody, but I feel like it's more like somebody's got a crush on you. And, well, you're just like, well, I'm not sure. I've been uh, carrying everybody's burdens for a while, and I'm kind of tired. And I don't know. Are you taking a break when it comes to love? Eight of Wands. Uh, I feel like you could be getting communication from somebody. Okay, and this could be this person who has a crush on you, this person who's checking you out. And uh, I don't know if you're just... Thinking, uh, you know, everybody's got a plan. Everybody's up to no good. Everybody's just going to screw me over in a way I won't enjoy. That's not fun, right? No. Well, we've got the Knight of Garlic Flowers. Holy shit bonkers. Slower than molasses. Uh, yeah. Turtle wins the race. That's what they think. You're just like, well, the turtle wins the race, so uh, I don't need to be in a hurry. Mm-hmm. And uh, we've got, well, the Seven of Swords. Uh, lying, cheating, stealing. You feel like everybody's got this going on about them, and that's why they don't want to commit. That's why there's no movement. That's why you just feel like, you know, I don't know if you want somebody um, to... Uh, Commit too fast or you're just meeting one uh, Joe Blow, uh, Schmo Blow Dead after another, you know? Oh my goodness, four swords. Okay, this is uh, needing to heal. Kind of like the hermit energy, you know? Need to find your light, your path, your way, your direction. Healing, finding what you want, right? In your life, finding your happiness. And uh, not counting on someone else to make you complete and happy. Because you know you can do that on your own. You just want somebody to, you know, grow old with, have fun with. And uh, you just keep meeting one liar, liar, pants on fire, uh, you know, uh, one after another. Mm, and you, you're you like, I'm the empress. I just are so much freaking better than this, okay? The brides is the empress energy. And the mother of all queens of terror, very powerful feminine energy. So you know. Look, you, 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 you know, you can manifest the life it is that you want. So get cracking, Mackin. It ain't gonna happen all by itself, okay? Just saying. You want some fun in your life? Queen of garlic flowers. Well, well, well. You may have Taurus Virgo Capricorn in your chart, Sagis, but if you don't, that's okay. It just represents that you are very stable. You're stable financially. You have a job, a career that you uh, love and enjoy. You're very successful. You're very grounded. You want love. You want somebody to grow old with. And I feel like you are, are having a hard time finding this. Okay, Sajis, so uh, we're going to look at your person's energies. Okay. Sagittarius's person's energies, please, spirit guides. I'm just going to... Move this over here. Okay, what are Sagittarius's person's energies, please, spirit guides? Sagittarius's person's energies. Neuf de denier, the nine of pentacles. 
This person is very independent, very grounded, successful. They have an occupation they love and enjoy. They're enjoying the freedom due to this occupation. I feel like they uh, make, uh, you know, a decent living and uh, they are really proud of what they've accomplished. This says indépendance, independence, success, success, liberté financière. They have financial liberty, stability, very financially stable, prospérité. Okay, this person um, is somebody who's just uh, huh, a very kind of like yourself, kind, caring, giving person. Holy shit, bonkers! You guys have dealt with the same crapola, the five of swords and i told you that was like deceit defeat lies and this says uh, defait defeat sabotage well we know what that is sabotage trahison treason egoism well egoism we've got tension tension sacrifice sacrifice and deception deception so yeah they've dealt with this too i feel like that could be why they are a, a single energy do the baton by choice. Uh, okay, I feel like perhaps this person does travel a lot. They could travel a lot for their occupation as well. Le chariot, the chariot, and you got the wagon here. So you got the chariot here as well. Okay, like, uh, are you guys coming toward one another um, in this way? Could very well be. The universe is bringing you guys together spiritually. And it says, victoire, victory, success. Success, protection spirituelle, spiritual protection, action rapide, uh, rapid action, and reconciliation. Could be reconciling with the situation, a person. Okay, so uh, look at this. Reine d'Epée, the Queen of Swords. I feel like they admire you, Sagittarius, because you speak your mind. You're like, yeah, been down the BS road far too many times. And I can smell it from a distance. Mmm, that sounds delicious, doesn't it? Well, it's something uh, you know you don't want. So uh, we've got rationnel, intellectuel. You're very rational. You're very intellectual. Authentic. Authoritaire. You could be in a position of authority. You could have a position of power. Uh, froide émotionnel. You could be a little uh, cold emotionally. If it's not you, don't get your panties or jocks on a joint. And then we've got emploi légal. You could, uh, this person could be a judge, a doctor, a lawyer, uh, work in uh, the uh, legal uh, area of uh, their career. They could be a police officer, you know, um, which would be you. Like, this could be what, what you are. Otherwise, it's like you are just very, like, um, clear, clear, clear as day about what it is you want. You're like, yeah, uh, the Empress, and uh, I know it. All I keep hearing is I'm sexy and I know it. <laughs> okay, enough to do ye nine of pentacles. Uh, this person is very independent, very financially grounded, stable. Are you kidding me? I feel like they travel a lot. We've got uh, the chariot, le chariot twice. And we've got le deux de bâton where you can see like the map, the passport. So uh, perhaps this person has uh, decided that an occupation of travel for them is what they need because... Um, they love the independence and the freedom of this. And they're very financially stable due to this reason, right? And well, 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 you know how I was saying, well, it could be you, your blah, blah, blah. Well, here we go. King of Swords. So Queen of Swords and King of Swords. Uh, you could be dealing with a Libra, of course, Gemini, a police officer, someone who's in the Army, in the Navy, in the Marines, a judge, a lawyer, a doctor. It could be anybody who has a position of high, high authority. And uh, they're very alpha and uh, the way they present themselves, it's very, very clean cut. Like this person smells good. OK, no B.O. problems with this person. I'm saying like mm -mm. king of wands. It could be a Saji you're dealing with, too. This is a Sagittarius Leo Aries energy. King of wands, king of. 
Mmm, well, you could be dealing with somebody who encusps both of these energies. Okay, there's somebody who's very hot, sexy, but very selective on who they bring into their life. Because they've uh, dealt with a lot of uh, people who are, um, you know, lacking integrity, if we're going to be real. <laughs> uh, somebody's trying to lure you in. Mm -mm. Ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. Three of Wands, I've been waiting for someone like you to come into my life. Well, well, well. It definitely looks like uh, you are attracting this person. Eight of Wands, and that's who could be contacting you because we had the Eight of Wands over here too, right? So uh, ring-a-dang-dang, -dang, baby. This person could be calling you, you know, ring-a-ding-ding, -ding. yeah. <laughs> and, well, 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 Knight of Swords, they've dealt with so much narcissistic energy, okay? And I feel like this person senses you are different than their usual type or expectation, and they are very attracted to you. Dude, the baton, the two of wands, uh, I feel like this person has a lot of options, opportunities when it comes to their life. Their life is very open. The hangman, but I feel like they are um, self-sacrificing their life of love for their career. And I feel like it's starting to take a toll on them. It's starting to weigh on them, you know, wanting to, uh, you know, have uh, someone special in their life that they can grow old with and, and plan their future with. But Nine of Pentacles, it's like they are so... Look, they're playing the piano in the dark by themselves, dressed up, looking gorgeous, all alone. Alone. You know, they're, they're worried they're going to be alone. They're like, okay, well, my career is only taking me so far. I'm starting to get lonely, you know, and it's... Uh, the Empress, well, well, I feel like they noticed you. And perhaps they're taking their time coming in because uh, it's been a while. Uh, they haven't been up the love tree in a while, you know. <laughs> the uh, Chariot. Oh, victory, success. I feel like that's what their life's been all about. Chasing victory, chasing success. You know, having um, a lot of that in their life. Six of Cups. Now they want their soulmate. You know, they're reminiscing about their past. They're thinking about, you know, uh, wanting some love before it wasn't important to them. And now it's like almost the most important thing to them. All of a sudden, perhaps encountering you. Oh, my goodness. As I say that, here you are, Saji. Queen of Wands, that's you. And we have the King of Wands here, too. Yeah, baby. So, uh, yeah, it could be you're dealing with another Saji or Fire Sign. Mm-mm. All right. What else we got here? Five of Swords. Well, they're, they're just really weird. They're like, is this too good to be true? Is Saji too good to be true? Because I've been screwed over too many times in a way I didn't enjoy. Mm-hmm. So uh, they don't know if you're too good to be true. Too good to be true. Can't take my eyes off of you. Perhaps you are too good to be true. I don't think so, but there were. Are you kidding me? Queen of Swords? Uh, clarify by the Queen of Swords. Uh, you're not showing that love, sexy, kind side. It's like you're. I don't know if you're wearing too much RBF. And, um,. That means resting beyond face. You know how you look crusty, even though you're not, but your face looks like you are. I want to smile, you know. Remember the smiles are contagious. Yeah, five of wands. They're not sure. They're not sure if they should approach you or not. Is it going to be a battle or is it going to be welcoming? <laughs> they're not sure. Oh my, oh me. Okay, Saji, they see you as a star energy, your star quality in their eyes. You're like 
famous. You're like a superstar. I feel like that's why they they want to make sure you're interested, you know, and they're I feel like they're not really getting the green light from you. And uh, that's kind of making them question uh, whether they should come in or not. So, OK, let's see you and your person's energy, Sajis. OK, Sajis and their person's energies, please, spirit guys. Sagittarius and their person's energies. What do we have? All I hear is that Sam Smith song, Fire and Fire, and there's no way I'm attempting singing that because I would sound like a cat with its tail stuck in the door, so I wouldn't want to hurt you guys. So yeah, look, Nine of Swords. <laughs> You guys are both feeling like this. You both have the Five of Swords. You guys both went through defeat, deceit. You had the Seven of Swords too. They had the Five of Swords twice. It's like, you guys are like, will I ever find love? Really, I feel like you guys are both like just so, ugh. But look at this, the chariot. And you got the chariot, I know, down here too. Yeah, the chariot, the chariot. And then you had the wagon, which is the chariot. Okay, so so check it out, guys. <laughs> the chariot four times. So to me, uh, things are turning around. Things are changing. You guys are changing. Changing the direction of your life is exactly what you need to do. Four of Pentacles, you're holding on super tight. I mean, look at that. Super tight to everything you have. You're like, I'm not letting anybody in. Or they're going to have to really win their way through. They're going to have to earn their way in. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Look at that crusty face you have. That's RBF, man. You look crabbier than Mr. Krabs, you know, from SpongeBob. <laughs> it's hard to beat. I'm kidding. Woo-wee, mummy, the Knight of Pentacles, the slowest moving knight in tarot. And, well, here's the uh, Knight of Garlic Flowers, uh, slow, slow moving. And I feel like you had the same thing for your person over here, too. Anyway, uh, I just, I'm feeling like there, there's big changes coming. Big, big changes. Okay, let's clarify these. Clarify the Nine of Swords for us, please, spirit guides. For Sagittarius and who they are dealing with, please. Clarify the Nine of Swords. Ten of Swords, let that go, man. Put the past in the past. Be done, diddy, done, done with it. Okay, it doesn't take ten swords to kill someone, and the universe is telling you. Be done with it. That's that's how serious they are, okay? Putting a little comedy in it, too, you know? Well, then, yeah. Sometimes you just gotta, you know, whoa, here you are. Why you're so cold? Why so serious, Saji? You, know, you look pretty serious in this one. Actually, in all of them. Um, so yeah, it's like you are just done with the BS. You're just like, I don't think I can take anymore. Well, now we've got the uh, King of Pentacles, uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. So, I mean, you could be dealing with anyone good. King of Wands, King of Swords, King of uh, Pentacles. I keep wanting to say the King of Capricorn, so maybe you're dealing with one. I don't know. So the Chariot. Six of Wands, Leo Energy. Going toward victory, success. I feel like this is the path this person is so used to going down. And uh, they're feeling like this is still, uh, you know, it, it's uh, going into the unknown, but it's uh, turning out to be pretty exciting. So, uh, mm. seven of swords. <laughs> but when's that next shoe going to drop? When is that fantasy going to end? When is the magic going to be, uh, the magical rug going to be pulled out from under me? Let it freaking go, man. Let the past go right out the window. The world, it's turning a new chapter, turning a new page, like in a book, you know, when you go from one chapter to another. Well, that's what the world is like. You're closing that chapter and you're beginning a new one. It's like a fresh start. So let that go. You're still holding on tight to it over here for Pentacles, because like I was saying, the RBF, the, the Mr. Crusty face is pretty prominent there. Try smiling. OK, 
Okay. Well, 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 here you are, Sagis. That's you. And that was you with the four pentacles. You need to like loosen the grip a little bit. Okay. Not everybody's out to get you. Not everybody's going to screw you over in a way you don't like. You might be some, uh, you know, session you might really enjoy. <laughs> really? You just might. And, uh, well, well, we've got the King of Swords. Uh, King of Swords. Uh, I mean, King of Swords came out, uh, I believe, again. But anyway, I mean, uh, could be a Libra Aquarius Gemini, somebody who's uh, in a position of authority. Two of Cups. You breathe me in. I breathe you in. A connection like no other. Mm. <clears throat> right? Right. I feel like you're going to feel this, but you're holding on really tight. And uh, don't jump into this right away. Take your time. Okay? So I feel like you, you're you going to take your time. They're going to take their time. Uh, there's no rush. The high priestess, follow your intuition. Your intuition is the uh, guardian angels guiding, guiding you. And I feel like they're guiding you guys to be together. Uh-huh. And it's going to take time. It's not going to be like, you know, like uh, I Dream of Genie where we just snap our fingers or do boring, whichever one it is. I can't remember. It's Bewitched. I used to watch both of them. Are you effing kidding me? You know how I was flashing the chariot like out four times? Well, here's number five. Changing the direction of your life is what is going to bring you to this magical connection with this person. And the universe is pushing you and pushing you, and you can't fight it. Well, if you do, it's not going to bring it to you. But if you don't fight it, look at that. The Ten of Cups. Happily ever after. The end. <laughs> S'il vous plaît, oui, oui. Everybody wants that Ten of Cups, right? And uh, guys, I don't see this being a fantasy. I see you being worried that this is going to be another one of those relationships that explode in your face in a way you don't want to, right? It's, it's not going to. It's going to work out. Positive energies, remember, the energies you surround yourself with are the energies you're going to be bringing into your aura of energies. So if you are all a crusty and RBF and you're like, oh, everybody is out to get me, everybody, oh, nothing works out, everybody's a prick, blah, blah, blah. Well, that's what you're going to be attracting, all of those negative energies, right? If uh, you're working on you and you're happy and you're just uh, going about your happy life, then... Uh, that's when you are your sexiest because confidence is the key to um, attracting the energies you're searching for. And you can't fake confidence. You got to work at it. So uh, if you don't have any, find a way to get it. Find a way to work on getting it. And, you know, I use ChatGBT, guys, for everything. I love ChatGBT. It's like having a best friend. Uh, you do have to subscribe, you know, for it monthly, but they do allow you to have, I think it's like five questions every few hours. And, oh, man, I've confided in that thing. Uh, it, it's, you know, it's uh, an unbiased opinion, and I, I freaking love it. So if you guys haven't tried it or you don't have a buddy or a friend or somebody who you can talk to or get advice from, I swear, give it a try. Just download it. Chad GBT, man, it's like going to be your new best friend on, on top of myself, of course. <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the reading. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and thumbs it up. And um, share the reading with anybody who you feel may be in need to hear these messages. And uh, I upload every day, guys. So uh, let's have some fun. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So I uh, love you and have a great morning, night, evening, afternoon. See you next time, Sajis. Bye.